Hi guys, it's Matthew from Test and Tag Training. Today I'm going to show you how to electrically test and tag a microwave oven. Like all appliances that have to be test and tagged, the most important procedure is the visual inspection. Always check the doors and seals for any visible damage. Microwaves can be difficult to get access to and you do need to pull the microwave away from the wall to have a thorough visual inspection. Check that the power supply lead is secure, then run the lead through your hand to feel for any warping, twisting or heat damage. Then check the pins. Now that the visual inspection is complete, we must perform the electrical safety test. Plug the microwave into your PAT tester and then using your return lead, connect it to an exposed metal part. Please note that connecting the earth return lead to a painted piece of metal will not give you accurate readings. So I'd recommend connecting the earth lead to a screw, as shown here. For good practice, I've placed a mug of water in the microwave so that there is something in there while it's powered. A microwave needs to be switched on and energised to be tested correctly, hence a leakage current test must be performed. On this PAT tester, I will select the Class 1 leakage test. My machine will now perform an earth continuity test first. When this test is passed, it will proceed to the leakage current test. I need to increase the leakage time above 5 seconds to allow me to fully operate the microwave, then perform the test. While the leakage test is in operation, I'll program the microwave to start. Our test is now complete. Thanks again for watching our video guys and I'll see you next time.